Right. Next, we're going to talk about UCI. That's user-created icons. We do that through uh, Emodio. Our description's really long, so we're going to talk about that in the next video. We do when we talk about uh, DNSC. Emodio is a new program from uh, Emodio.com. It lets you obtain really fun contents really easily. You can download your firmware. To check that out, go to www.emodio.com. It's uh, E-M-O-D-I-O.com. Okay. Now let's take a look at the voice recorder. Go under Prime Pack, under Record. And see here we've got our uh, recorder right here. Um, this will tell us the name of the file that it's going to be. And click the record button here. Also it's letting us know that the play pause button is record and stop. Start recording. As soon as I start the screen is going to go blank. There you go. Now we sit here and talk for a minute while this uh, is recording what we're saying and then we want to stop doing that. Push the play pause button. And it saved it there for us. Now we head back out and go under music, recorded files. There's a file right there, let's listen to it. Now we sit here and talk for a minute while it's uh, recording what we're saying, and then we want to stop doing that. Push the play pause. Now we sit here and talk for a minute while this uh, is recording what we're saying, and then we want to stop doing that. Push the play pause. And see as we push the button and stop there. Let's head back out. Now let's take a look at the locking feature on the P2. Go under settings, system, lock. Okay, you can turn it off if you've got it on and you don't want it on anymore, but let's actually turn it on first. Okay, I've got to enter my password. 1111. Okay. Now the locking is on. Let's turn off the P2. Turn it back on. You see it asks for the password. Let's try to type something wrong in. See what it does. Password not confirmed. I have to go to uh, reset the password. Let's type in the real password now. Okay. Now we go under settings again. If we don't like the password we've got, we can go ahead and change it. Enter password. We've got to type the old one in first. Okay, now the new password. Zero, 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 zero. Okay, now confirm it. Zero, 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 zero. Okay, now the password's been changed. And now we can go ahead and you can turn off the, the locking if you want to. You can keep it on. It's really nice, especially if you have like any kind of sensitive material on here. You can go ahead and keep people out of it. Let's take a look at another feature. And now let's take a look at the user presets for the DNSC. Um, before, we could only have one user preset, but now it allows us to have up to three DNSC presets um, that we customize ourselves. And if you feel like you need more, you can download other ones using Emodio. Let's take a look. We can do editing here on the P2. It, DNSC, my DNSC. So we have our different users here, user one, two, and three. Now to edit it, we go ahead and use this pencil icon down here. And so we have EQ. We can go ahead and do all of our editing work here. You can select all, move all the levels up if you want to. We have 3D and bass. You can move those up and down if you want to. Then we have clarity. And change the clarity level we got on here. Let's head back out. Uh, user 2, same thing, pencil icon. Turn clarity all the way up. 3D and base. All right, then we have EQ. Select one. And change all the levels to whatever we want them to be. So if you listen to rock music, you can go ahead and Set your level presets to where it should be for that kind of music, and then if you want to switch to hip hop, go change your your uh, DNSC user preset to something that's more suitable for hip hop or dance music, whatever you want. So since we can have more than uh, one now, we have a lot more options than we had before. Let's take a look at another option, another uh, feature. 
Right, now let's take a look at the last feature updated on the new firmware uh, update for the P2. Go to Settings, System, Hold Option. Now before when you hit the Hold button, it would go ahead and lock everything so you couldn't uh, do anything until you unlock the P2. But uh, now we can go ahead and we can just lock out the touch screen. We've got the hold button on there. Okay, head back out. Now we're going to put it on hold. You can see the side buttons still work on here. Change our volume. We can go ahead and play and pause on here. It's nice if you got it in your pocket. You don't have to pull it out, unlock it. You just feel around in your pocket for the right buttons. As you see, the touch screen is not operating right now just the side buttons. Play, pause, and everything makes it a lot simpler to use. Um, that's pretty much all we've got for the P2 today. Uh, until next time, see you later.